where has Airbnb been all of my life, seriously. Hey, what's up you guys? It's Alex and welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to do a really fun vlog of our stay at an Airbnb and this is our first Airbnb experience ever. So, and honestly, our host, Michelle, set the standard so high that we're calling it the Michelle standard. I'll give you guys a quick background. Ryan actually surprised me for my 26th birthday and he said, Alex, I'm gonna take you out somewhere. You're not gonna know where it's at. And literally, if you know me, I'm like a kid. I'm like, tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. He has also never been to Cayucos. I've never even heard of Cayucos <laughs> because my birthday falls on a time where you think the weather is not gonna be that great, but it's California and the weather feels like it's always awesome. So we got really lucky for like the third year in a row where we've got a really sweet deal on um, on a spot that usually it's pretty booked out. We checked in at 3 p.m. and we immediately threw our stuff down and went by the water because we wanted to soak in the last moments of sunlight because the sun was heading down and we just wanted to enjoy that. Isn't this beautiful you guys? Beautiful sunset. Dog barking in the back. You literally cannot ask for more. The house that we're staying at is that one, somewhere over there. And I'm staying right here. <laughs> quick, and I wanted to give you guys a first view of what we walked into and, uh, and point out all the little cool things that Michelle, our host, had put into the details of the room. Really, really worth it, and total disclaimer, I am not being paid at all. This is my 100% honest review of this location, and I think, spoiler alert, I love it. This is not big news. I think the cool thing about our host is that she put in so much thought into the little things, and when I give you guys a tour around the room, you'll see what I mean. Every little thing is labeled. Anything that you can think of that you might forget on a vacation or a trip somewhere, it is here. Umbrella, sunscreen, aloe vera, feminine product, free wine, everything, everything, everything that you can possibly think that you're like, oh shoot, I might need it. Even little gifts. She gave us little gifts. It's so, so sweet. She left me a cute birthday sign. I mean, you can't get any better than that. It's like, she's like a super host. And the view itself of the room is just out of this world. On my blog, alexslife.com, I'll be sure to upload more pictures and kind of go in depth about what I, what I experienced. And it's so, it's just so amazing. And if you are looking for even a solo getaway, it is so worth just waking up, even in the middle of the night, to the ocean right there. And the moonlight just, illuminates everything. It's not like it's pitch dark. It's you can see the waves and how the king tides actually come all the way up to the stairway. It was just breathtaking and amazing. Seriously, check out that killer view. So like I was saying, our hosts were so sweet. They gave us a bottle of wine, a corkscrew, bottle opener, two wine glasses, Dove chocolate. Please enjoy the complimentary wine and cold beer in the fridge. Cheese and crackers and other beverages are also available to you. Enjoy your stay. Handmade wine tote some dry salted almonds and a fig bar. So this is where the um, organic creamy garlic and herb cheese that we immediately devoured on site. Keurig coffee maker. This is where the crackers were, again, we immediately devoured on site. They left us a traveler's library. Cards, dominoes. Plenty of more wine glasses. Let's check out the fridge. 
We got the beer. There was another bottle of wine there. Half and half. Sparkling water. We ate Coke. It, everything is literally labeled, you guys. Utensils, paper towels, sugar, napkins, honey sweeteners, hot cocoa, hot cocoa, hot oatmeal. And look at this, this is the cutest part. A little picnic basket. Okay guys, so there are two different kinds of people in this world. There's people that use coasters and there are people that do not use coasters. Michelle, our host, is clearly a coaster lady. Ryan and her will get along just fine. I'll show you guys the bathroom area. They left us a gift, a gift for you. Cute little soap. Like I said, everything is labeled. Everything that you can possibly need, even a sewing kit, you guys. Isn't that the sweetest? This place is just awesome. Feminine products, you guys know, it's super important. Shower, look how huge the shower is. You even have mouthwash. If you want your towels replaced, Michelle is so cool. Everything you can possibly ask for. I'm gonna turn all this off. And I haven't gone in here. What? I actually never went in here, so extra storage space here. We just woke up, and this is our view. <laughs> this is awesome, you guys! Seven in the morning. It's so worth it. How do you leave the house with a view like this? <laughs> I don't know, I wouldn't. I literally would not leave the house if I had a view like this. Wakey wakey, eggs and bakey. <laughs> hey, <laughs> what's up stud? <laughs> That is probably my favorite thing in the world. Waking up and the moon is still out. Tell everyone why you weren't sleeping last night. <laughs> he wants me to tell everyone why I wasn't sleeping last night. Two words, wine bottle. <laughs> when we first got here, we got hooked up with a really nice bottle of wine and um, Ryan took me to this really cool place called, what was it called, the gallery? He's <laughs> shaking his head. What is it? I think it was the galley. The galley, sorry, not the gallery, the galley. He took me to this beautiful place called the galley and it served, it's basically, um, it serves seafood, American food. You can find it all. A little pricey, but so worth it, especially if you're out here trying to do a staycation or getaway. So, I had wine there. <laughs> wine is what happened, and I don't normally drink, and I woke up at like three in the morning, and I brought my book with me, and I just started reading my book, but I kept tossing and turning. So Michelle's gonna come down at some point, maybe around in an hour, to bring us breakfast, which is so sweet. Um, honestly, we were joking with her. She set the Michelle standard. Check it out, we got breakfast. They gave us an egg. This is so good. Oh my god. It's actually like really hot. Ugh, ow. Okay, ow. <laughs> you guys, this is the cutest thing. <laughs> He's eating the dolphin. I'm gonna start with the dog. Dun, 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 dun. Ah! We need the viewers help on that one. We need the <laughs> Let's 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 take a poll. Where is the remote? The only person I feel like would know is Ryan who last used so it. Nice I'll put everything in cute little pouches. Ocean front getaway. And she leaves notes on everything. You know, this says Whoops! Sorry. 
<laughs> also known as a label. Ryan, okay, so the more you get to know Ryan, the more you'll find out he's kind of a low-key savage. Anyway, fireplace remote. Everything is literally labeled, you guys. Okay, let's see. Oh, hmm. what? Yes. We're feeling fancy. Cheers. So if you guys liked this video and want to check out more, please subscribe, support the channel, give it a huge thumbs up, and check out my blog, alexoslife.com. I'm also on Instagram, same thing, same handle, with an extra E, because the other one was taken. I'm gonna go outside, I'm gonna enjoy this view before we gotta jet out to Southern California, so I will see you guys next time, bye-bye.